To get to Sorrento's railway station from Tasso Square, you go to the eastern side of the square and follow the Corsa Italia. As you leave the square, you pass the yellow-coloured Church of Antuario della Madonna del Camine on your left. You continue up Corso Italia and take the second street on the right, which is called Via Ernesto de Curtis. This is opposite Piazza Angelino Lauro, which you can see up ahead on the left. You can see the station building at the end of the street. Sorrento station is the terminus at the end of this branch of the Circumvesuviana railway, so you can't miss your stop on the way back. It's from here that you can get trains to Castelmare di Stabia, Pompeii and Naples. The excavations at Pompeii are just over the road from the station there. To get to the platforms, you have to go up the stairs. As the name implies, the Circumvesuviana network circles Mount Vesuvius. The train also stops at nearby Sant'Agnello. The station, as you would expect, has amenities such as a snack bar and a taxi rank. I conclude this film looking down the Via Ernesto de Curtis, which is named after the man who composed Torna a Sorrento, the famous song about returning to Sorrento. The lyrics to the song were written by Ernesto's brother, Gian Battista de Curtis, whose bust stands in front of the station in recognition of this achievement. It's rather appropriate for these two brothers to be celebrated in this way. The station is, of course, the location where people first arrive in Sorrento. It is also the place where they often leave with dreams of eventually coming back.